Hey you. Yeah you. Welcome to the video. Before we actually get into this video, uh, I gotta explain myself. At first I was gonna show off Asia and Tower, but uh, Tower, I, I just hate Tower in this game so much. If anything, I personally feel like it needs a rebalance because having enemies one shot you as soon as the as soon as it starts is really annoying but this video i went from showing off asia to just full-on ranting of how tower is like really strong but i did make it pretty decently far after i found like a pretty good team but just letting you guys know that I do go on like a little bit of a rant. Some people won't agree with it. Some people will. Uh, personally, Tower is really annoying. It's probably like the most end game thing right now. Probably the strongest thing in the game is pretty much Tower. Or Fortress don't, doesn't even touch Tower, to be honest. If any of you guys are having trouble with Orc Fortress, trust me, Tower is a whole different level along with some really tedious buffs also so yeah enjoy my rant and being tilted i'll see you guys next time to the peace out hey guys what's up it's both of you and only and today we got asia and this is gonna be my first time using her it's on a tower we're gonna see if she actually can put her money where her mouth is on a, you know, max passive. <laughs> uh, if you guys are unsure, you did not see my video of me explaining or going through their skills. Asia is sort of a really, really unique tank for like PvP or PvE. Uh, I feel like she's an all-around tank. Uh, I will upgrade these gears sooner or later. But right now, we're going to be rocking this and see what happens. Yeah, as of right now, I'm still farming those. Uh, we do not have new quests and stuff like that, but I will go over that story tomorrow. I just, I just don't want to upload a whole bunch of Dragon Blaze videos right now because you guys know I'm still variety. I like to play a lot of different other games and explore some and expose you guys to some new ones. But we're going to go into Tower and get into it. All right, maybe I should explain her skill before I actually just jump right in where is she we gotta put her in here anyway Asia wait did I pass her I feel like I passed her I definitely did there she is <laughs> all right we're gonna replace her for Kronos because Kronos dies like at the start of the match Alright, so, allow me to explain how she's going to work for Tower. Why I think she can be pretty useful for that. One, she gives us a whole bunch of stamina and a whole bunch of resist. For, like, just pretty much overall damage. Um, two, she weakens magic by a lot. So, magic dealers, you just met your counter here. Your counterpart. And as for Aegis, um... Uh, third passive this is where she can't be one-shotted she can only receive 12 percent of that damage max and she reflects it back if it's magic damage her max is what we need to keep everybody from getting one-shotted so the rest of these are up to you this is pretty much this is pretty much protection just increasing that to protect uh, whoever she's protecting, which will probably be uh, Bonnie. As for this one, this one is her immunity and her um, invisibility, which her arc is not actually not bad. She's actually worth arcing, in my opinion. In my opinion, that is. She actually could be around for quite a while. Uh, people know her power already. Uh, you know what? That's not all I think we're going to take in. The only thing I'm worried about is the helper unit. Because the helper unit is going to come in afterwards. Which is going to suck. Alright. 
let's do it. Let's see what happens and see if I was correct on she could probably be used in tower. If she can, then yeah, she's overall for a, a lot of content. So she could, she should keep everybody from getting one shot. Because if somebody gets one shot at the start of the turn, then that just means tower's broken. <laughs> yeah, look at that. This is tower. She didn't even proc her skill. She didn't even get the proc. It. That's the sad part. Tower is insanely difficult. Oh look, now she procs it. This is why I tell you guys, Tower is retardedly strong. That's so sad. She, she doesn't even get to use it just because everybody gets insta-killed inside of Tower. That's the insane part. And she can live with it and it's just fine. She doesn't care. She's like, oh, you know what? You just killed my whole team. Who cares? Like, look at this. Who are less than 40. So you can't even proc this. That's so sad. That, that actually sucks too. But on the plus side... Considering the fact that she survived pretty long in there, longer than everybody else, that is actually pretty good. But I'd say she is probably still great for like tanking a lot of things, especially PvP. Like she's gonna be a monster in PvP. You're gonna, you're gonna hate her so much in PvP. I, I already look at her and I already hate her. But yeah, unfortunately, she's. She's not going to be really good in tower, unfortunately. Uh, maybe I still have to level up gears or something. They really should fix tower. No way a tower should just be one-shotting units. To the point where... You, you can't do anything. <laughs> they buff tower like so many times. They're just adding up more floors. Alright. Ah, that's unfortunate. But yeah, it seems like we got 90 floors. I wonder if it's going to be a while before we get like the 100. Uh, let's see where everybody stopped. Well, pff, never mind. Looks like most people have stopped around. Oh my god, this man. If you guys don't know, I've had a personal hatred with Death Crown. Just because he's one-shotted my team inside of like, um, I think when Tower was separated between Hero and Busters. Busters were pretty much the whole key. Like the whole key situations we had where you put keys on your characters and transform them into different characters, which don't no longer exist in the game. But I hate this man. <laughs> he kept one shotting my team. Or no, he wasn't one shotting my team. This man was literally tanking the crap out of my team and just mowing us down afterwards. And when we would get him so close to dying. We'd just be like, oh, oh, that's cool. I'm just going to kill the rest of your team. <laughs> Death Crown is so annoying. But yeah, Tower is like really, really difficult. I would say Tower is more of in-game with the way they made it. It's funny because people even tell me, people have told me that they get one-shotted around here. A few people told me they get one shot at um, seven. And I noticed, I believe some of those were uh, reflection damage. Reflection damage hurts like hell because you're basically killing yourself. That's basically what it is. You're literally killing yourself. We had a character that countered that, I believe. I believe. Don't remember who it was. But this is who I'm having trouble with now. Only reason why... All my cooldowns are halved, which hurts. Hurts like hell, to be honest. If you're wondering what it feels like. <laughs> Hold up. Let me do something weird here. What? 
No, you. <laughs> I want to try this out. I doubt this is going to work, but I'm curious. I don't think you can outspeed them in damage. I think that would be amazing. Right here is if everybody was just applying the buffs already. But as for tower, I guess the devs think it's a good idea for your characters just to sit here and do nothing during the timer goes down. I would more appreciate it if my characters were doing something like buffing themselves before I went in here. Not that crap. Ah, right, yeah, guys, let's just sit here and die. And look, Kronos is the only one left. What is he gonna do on his own? No idea. But, you guys know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna put in Shin. Yeah, we're gonna put in Shin and have her revive everyone. Because I just noticed it takes him a long time to die. And Bonnie has no revives, unfortunately. Bonnie's a really good healer for PvP and PvE, as long as it's a physical team. But the thing is, she just doesn't have a revive for her. So that's her unfortunate downfall. I could use her. But, eh. She's only good for guild loot, to be honest. <laughs> she's literally only good for guild loot. I could do this. I could. Hmm. If only I could take out my character. Because I already know my character sucks compared to all of these overlords. Can I just take out my character and replace it with another character, please? <laughs> that would be fantastic. I thought this was going to work, but... Hey, boss damage. Let's see what happens. I'm just curious. I'm just trying out different teams now. You never get anywhere without trying different teams. She's going to get one-shotted, though. Because she doesn't have any uh, things to stop. Yeah. Figured. Oh, I should have... Uh, well, too late now. I had an idea. I had a very good idea. Since Kai... Has a little bit of something that keeps him alive. I should have put Kai in here and put her in the back. But the most start-off problem is them using their strongest skills off start. Okay. Game? Jesus Christ. <laughs> but yeah, that's the that's the worst part. Them just using all their skills at once and just mowing you down. Alright, let's go. Let's try that. Since Kai basically has a immunity and he hits immortality once he uh, gets low HP. Alright, here we go. Yep. There he goes, he hit it. But she died afterwards. That is just so sad, dude. But they killed him. Could this be the moment Bull passes this stage? Probably not. <laughs> Alright, you guys are basically just telling me I should put Kronos over here. Well. We finally did it. There we go. She tanked out pretty well. Not half bad. There we go. Like I said, you always have to try the perfect team. Just keep switching around, changing around a little bit. You'll get it eventually. But I doubt this is going to last. 
But not bad, she's still alive, hasn't died yet. We have buffs on, so that should carry us a few more floors. There soon will be a floor that we just get one-shotted and we can't pass again. Just like the initial floor that we were on. But either way it goes, tower needs to be fixed. Tower is just insane either way it goes. Especially on start off. Just fighting these guys are is just a chore. You know you wanna know something that's funny? They even one shot arcs in here. I've seen a whole team get wiped out from a dude who just was just like, how do I even beat this tower? I'm just sitting here like you don't. You just watch it happen. How do you start up damage? I, I don't know. Don't ask me. <laughs> I've been struggling with this floor for years now. <laughs> Alright, Kai's back. I love Asia's, like, shield. It's so dope. I think Asia's definitely my female, my favorite female character right now in this game. It's because they were looking. Her shield just looks so badass. She could turn it into a freaking axe. Alright. We got a healing squad. Oh, God. We have not run into a gala in, like, so long. I don't need this in my life. To be honest, I'm gonna just see how fat see how far we get. I'm not gonna stop it for the extra damage of getting her into the party and putting Kronos out. Not even gonna do it. I'm gonna just sit here, see what happens. Let's see how far you can take me, game. <laughs> take me above and above and beyond. I wonder what debuff these guys got. Oh, there's Kai again. Oh, he's died. <laughs> when it comes to revivers, Chin is probably still the best reviver either way. Even if her revive is timed, she's probably still the best, one of the best healers for like both teams if you want like reviving because she can revive herself she's basically like an older version of black and black was actually really good back then now she's just dead in some uh majesties i don't even think she's a priest anymore she changes into something i think archer not sure All I know is I have a lot of farming to do. Yep, go ahead and revive Kai or my archer for some reason. Please revive Kai. Nope, you're going to revive my archer, you idiot. And back to death she goes. And you revived her again. What do you have against Kai? My DPS, dude. Not only that, it wouldn't be so bad if you didn't have to kill the boss in a time limit. Because if you guys are new to tower, if you take too long with the main boss, it revives all the rest of the enemies. Like that. Which makes no sense at all for a tower to do that. I never got that at all. What was the point of reviving all the minions that you killed and got out of the way like I'm sorry to ran on tower but this needs to be said tower's broken even if you guys don't feel like it is well if the wells don't feel like it is it is it's 
so dumb. <laughs> Pretty sure a few people will actually agree with me that tower is insane in this game. It has mechanics that don't make any sense of reviving old mobs that you've killed. Oh god, Llewellyn, okay, chill, 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 chill. Yeah, if you don't know, Llewellyn hits everybody with that minigun, and she has, like, insane DPS. It actually does hurt. <laughs> Can she stand up against the Overlords? Nah. Nah, she's gonna get one-shotted. It's sad because I'm gonna miss Llewellyn. She was definitely one of my favorites. Until Aja came around and... <laughs> oh, boy. Unfortunately, somebody does... I haven't found a clean, like, really good, um, uh, I was gonna say. I haven't found, like, a real good, clean cut image of her. Transparent, like, peg. I wish there was one, but I have yet to find it. Here it comes, allies, if you don't. Kill her time, guys. Thank you. I know you guys hate going up a tower as much as I do. Alright, let's keep going. I'm pretty sure there's a whole bunch of people with a, like a whole arc team right now. I wouldn't even doubt it. Oh, I need the shoes because I would have the use my rubies just to buy these. I'm trying to keep myself from using too much of my rubies. Okay, my tanks are taking a, a crap ton of damage right now. Kill the main DPS, please. Thank you. I also kind of wanted to know, what's the use of our characters right now? <laughs> Especially since our characters do no damage compared to the Overlords, and they die way faster than anything in the game. Every time I look back over, they're the first person dead. Like, automatically. Oh god, I don't need any more raid tickets. I'm pretty sure everybody knows I have, like, over 20k raid tickets. Oh no, not her. Mika's the last person we need right now. Oh, she's gonna nuke my freaking Chrono. Yep. This could be where we stop. Because Mika's retardedly strong. Come on, Kai. Come on. Come on, you can do... Nope. Wait, what? Okay. Yeah. Mika. Is a high DPS focus. <laughs> so she just focuses on one character and just... Destroys your whole team. Did you just say... Equal the enemy's HP? Who the fuck thought that was a good idea to give her that? What? Oh, max HP. Can... Do I have to repeat that? Whoever working at Gangville, you are evil for this time for this tower. Pure evil. How could you make something like this, you evil villain? <laughs> but uh, I do think Tower needs like a little bit of a rebalance, though, for real. All jokes aside, it does need a rebalance. That's just me personally. I know a lot of people won't agree to that. Oh. Oh yeah, I forgot. She can freeze a whole team also, by the way. Welcome to Mika. But we got it. There we go. That's what I needed to do. Keep my main DPS alive right here. Especially for bosses.
Do I still think it needs a rework by by seeing me pass all these stages? Yeah, still do. Even if I was to make it to floor 100, I would still think it needs a rebalance. What the hell kind of tell is that? Oh, yeah, she's dead. Oh, now she's back. <laughs> Alright, Kronos got his skills back. My boy's actually using that three. Wish he could use it way more often. He chooses not to. He's just like, nah, dude. I'm good. You're asking for too much of me. <laughs> what the hell is that on your back, dude? I, I don't approve. Kratos and Aja inside of this dungeon working together. Actually, not a half bad combo. Just because Aja's giving him those passives and Aja is actually keeping people alive. Because you guys saw that she got her, um, is it, no, I'm just going to call her is because I cannot see the rest of the name. I just forgot it. <laughs> but yeah, she kept is alive. Because you guys saw her get that shield. Ah, oh, man. Good old Kamel. I miss you, Kamel. You're like really fun. Best revive scroll in the game for sure. And holy shit, could you not wipe out half of my team, please? You know, I said I miss you. Now I don't actually. You maniac. Stop one shotting my team. At least let Shin come back to life. Oh my god. I hate this character so much. Yeah, here come the rest of the mobs coming back. Oh dear god. We're not doing any damage. Chin can't even stay alive all that long. Oh, Kronos is still alive somehow. Can you in Kronos, please? Oh yeah, the annoying fact that um, the damage goes up too. Already on monsterly strong characters. I'm surprised the mob hasn't even come back. How are you still alive? Kronos. You know, there's a such thing as dying. <laughs> God, stop healing her, please. Oh my god, the power is getting even stronger. Chin keeps getting one shot. <laughs> Chin's trying so hard to revive someone. It's <laughs> I feel so bad. But Chin is the only actual healer that can revive herself. So she's the only useful healer in this. Ah, oh, dude, feels bad. Kronos can't even save you. Now, if I get Asia up a little bit more and get Kronos and her together again, I can actually get past this because Asia would be protecting Chin each time she came back up. So Chin would actually be able to get more people up. Finally, you guys got the kill. So what was going on here? Oh, just stunning everyone, that's it. I didn't see too much stunning. I'm probably about to see it now. Alright, last round, boys. Then we're going to call it a video. I mean, I doubt we're going to live here, but, you know, we can... Always hope, you know. Q 
Kill her, please, for the love of God. Murder her. Get her out of here. With her dead, we win. Okay, never mind. With half my team dead, we lose. <laughs> okay, these two are still up. That's all that matters. Screw everybody else. I forgot Camel has freaking invincibility. Oh my god. See, that's what I mean. What's the point of it? Why does it exist? What is the point of them reviving? When I kill somebody, I want them to stay dead in tower. I'm just saying. This whole video is going to be complaining about tower, by the way. <laughs> uh. Alright. <laughs> now, can we revive Kai, please? Kai needs some help. We're gonna take our sweet time. Sorry, I kinda be back in a few seconds. Either that or it's gonna be my archer that returns in a few seconds. Revive one of them. Wait, what? Who did you revive for them to die again? That's my first question for you. Okay, Kai's back. And they're also back. Yay! You all see why I hate tower? But, yeah, naturally, tower is all about DPS. Uh, you have to have a good DPS to actually win inside a tower so that means you gotta be working on your teams every single day working on gear every single day tower is just one big in-game fuck you <laughs> that, that's how tower feels about us tower is just a go fuck yourself dude not here not in my yard not in my tower oh and there's two of my units now this is going to be troublesome because this is a magic team. And I feel like they're immune to Asia's stuff. Alright, who are you going to revive? Are you going to revive her please? She can literally help right now, thank you. There she is. This is why I love is because she is actually pretty decent for PvE content. And Tower is definitely good for her. I'm probably using a weird team that a lot of people haven't used before, right? <laughs> Just looking at Kai's hand. I thought it was like claws at first. Alright, re revive one of them, please. I swear to god, if I had to deal with Fry again. It's always Fry. Every time. I'm thinking about carrying two healers at this point. And just focusing on keeping her alive. Who did who did she revive? She didn't revive no one. I I'm confused a little bit. Okay. Wait, don't tell me it still depends on which tree, right? Oh no. If it is depending on which tree she uses, that's gonna be so dumb. It is. 
It's depending on which tree she uses. That explains it. That explains why this run has been going weird and why she hasn't been reviving certain people. So if you guys are curious how Chin works, she has a first skill, which is green, and it's pretty much the Tree of Life. She has a red, which is the Tree of Death. She uses the Tree of Death. At the end of the Tree of Death, like, finishing, nobody gets revived. I'm pretty sure that's just damage, DPS damage. She uses the Tree of Life. At the end of the Tree of Life, it revives someone. But one of her passives give it to where both of these work together. And that's why you see a fusion of these trees. If you see a fusion of this tree, then both skills should be going off, but I guess not. Oh dear god. Some of these characters are actually kind of confusing. Because I was actually thinking that Chin's skills would well, her revive would go off both trees, but it seems like it only goes off on Tree of Life and not Tree of Death. Which is very unfortunate. So that means if she uses Tree of Death, you just wasted so much time on getting a revive. Oh dear god, the scaler. Oh, she's gonna start spinning and murdering the whole team now. Oh, she killed Kronos, finally. How uh, cool. Yep, this is gonna be a stage where I will probably be defeated. Ah, uh, Gala, no. Why does that have to be Gala? Increase skill duration. Oh, no. That could be an issue. Alright, one more time. Wow, this is going to be a long video now that I think about it. It's been a while since I've done a long video of Dragon Blaze, though. Pretty sure some of you guys miss it. Got one shot of the straight off the bat, and now she has a spinning blade of doom that's gonna murder my whole team. Oh, there goes Kai, my DPS. Please kill her. Is kill her, please. You're literally our only DPS hope right now. Oh my god, thank you. <laughs> Alright, never mind. We're not defeated yet. We got. We got the 70s somehow. Oh dear god, I hate Tower. <laughs> That's literally just going to be a title of this video. I hate Tower. Oh, look at him. He thinks he's going to beat me. Well, he's, he's probably right. Because I don't know what effect he gets with this team. I'm about to say nobody's HP is falling down, so that's gonna be up. So up, well, probably something that's gonna be BS. All right, let me see this guy's effect. What does he get with his team? Seems like reflection is what I want to go. Up, oh, nope. He gets. <laughs> Wow. Holy crap. All right, one more time. I think this guy might be the one to stop me. Here we go. Can I get with those as thousand shoes, dude? Thousand shoes is a lot, especially with the way I have to farm this week. Could you hand those over? Oh, that looks like a straight no. He had other ideas. Nope. 
I'll okay then. I'll just go fuck myself. <laughs> That's apparently what you want. Alright. Yep. Laura 71 is where we stop. I want to see how many people are stuck on floor 71 now. Probably not a whole lot, maybe. Game. Thank you. Huh. I'm stuck here with like 42 other people. <laughs> okay. Oh boy. But yeah, you gotta see why I hate Tower. It has like a little mixture of so many random things that I question. But personally, this is from my point of view. Is that Tower is gonna be really difficult to get into considering that it's an in-game thing and even in-game this thing is insane to deal with. Hey, on the bright side, we got a thousand rupees from it and a few shoes. Oh yeah, I forgot about this. I gotta take all these. I want to I have decks, don't I? Let's get some... Mm, nah, we're gonna go get ahead and get some more decks, you know? <laughs> we'll be fine. Yeah, even more decks. We'll be fine. Because we have a lot of decks units. <sighs> Welcome to Tower, by the way, if you guys have not done it and experienced it. You're going to hate it. You are definitely going to hate it, as much as I do. But mostly Wells will tell you that it's pretty easy or they've gotten to, like, higher floors pretty easy. Or anybody who's been playing like way longer than you actually. <laughs> whoa, whoa, what the hell? Why did you sp split up my stuff? But personally, the only thing my pet peeve is what's the point of reviving a unit that died inside of my tower? I want a, I want some lure behind that. That's what I want. Hopefully they can explain to me the undying minions that that revive themselves. Like their freaking chin. Alright, I'm gonna send this over to my rogue since I nearly got my rogue to Plus 15? Nearly. I'm going to be using him for raids and stuff like that. That's pretty much it. But only when I get to 15. So, hold up. Let me check right quick of what level he is before I end off. Well, not level. Um, enhancement. Okay, so he's 13. Plus 13 right now. So, yeah. I'm going to go do that. Hope you guys enjoyed um, Asia. Really, really good. I recommend her. Team her up with Kronos since out of tower, and you pretty much got a really good defense team right there. Actually, something I want to try. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So I was talking about like two healers, right? You know, we're going to keep in our rogue. <laughs> Insane choice, but you know. We experiment and you're experimenting. I mean, it doesn't care any, matter anyway because he's still going to die. <laughs> I wanted to try the whole two healer thing. Okay, my team definitely changed coming in here. What? Okay, game. The game just destroyed itself. I've got teams changed depending on where you are. Oh, well, which character you are in tower. Which is a thing, apparently. Alright, there we go. 
Um, let's replace Kai and keep Iz and see what, see what happens. Come here, Bonnie. This is literally just out of curiosity. I thought this was going to work, too. Because they're definitely going to be getting back to one shot. Yep. Well then. Yeah, like I said. Welcome to tower. <laughs> Apparently if you bring Bonnie, your whole team gets destroyed. <laughs> Damn, this game really does not like Bonnie. But yeah, we're going to call it there. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out. <laughs> Screw Tower. Jeez. Swear it's going to get better real soon. Don't let anyone tell you what you should do. I got a clear view. We're going to make it soon. Just keep pushing through. Yo, what you got to lose? Just keep pushing through Cause what you got to lose